Hello, second grade. This is your math lesson for Tuesday. It is lesson 66. Um, you will need a pencil. You will need this piece of paper in your packet. And you will need to listen. Those are the three things that you'll need for this um, for this lesson. I'm going to share my screen with you so that you see what I'm doing. And I'll do this. And I will do this. Give me one second. Okay. Here we go. That is the lesson. There it is. Okay, perfect. Okay. So today we're going to be adding with double digits, right? But we're going to be adding money. You have done this plenty of time. Um, we're just going to review a little bit in this lesson about how to do it. So first, we have this chart, okay? So you're gonna have to listen to me so that we can fill it out, okay? So um, let me get my handy dandy. Um, okay, perfect. And I'm gonna move it over here. Okay, so for the first one, Let's say I have, ooh, let's erase that. Let's say I have um, 24 cents. Now, how many cents would I have, um, how many coins or what kind of coins would I need to make 24 cents? Now, you can use many different ways to make 24 cents. But the easiest way is to get two dimes. Okay, we're just gonna try our best here. Two dimes and one, two, three, four. Four pennies, right? Put one, one, one. And one. Okay, 24 cents would be two dimes and four pennies. We talked about this. The ten, the two, the two tens would be in the tens column. Good job. And the four ones would be in the ones column. Now, the chart looks a little bit different but it's pretty much the same. How much is a dime? 10 cents, that's correct. And how much is a penny? One cent, that is very correct. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask you to write 24 cents, two for the dime, two dimes, and four, the penny, so we have 24 cents. Now, let's say I have 35 cents. So I'm just gonna make little dots. One, two, three, right? Three for the dimes. 30, and then let's say I have one, two, three, four, five. So five pennies, so then I would put five over here. Now, I want you to solve it, so let's do it together. What is four plus five? Nine, good job. What is two plus three? Five, perfect. So our answer is 59 Sense. Don't forget to put that. It's already there for you. So now the second problem. Let's say I have 
52, 52 cents. Now, I know there are many ways to do this, but I just wanna focus on the ways that we've learned. So just pennies and dimes, okay? So we're gonna do five, one, two, three, four, five. Five, let's keep it the same. So let's erase that. Okay, so we're gonna do five, five dimes. One, one, two, three, four, five. And two pennies, so one, two. So we're gonna put 50, two. Perfect. Now, let's say, your mom gave you another 16 cents. So that is one dime and six pennies, right? One, two, three, four, five, put it over here, six, six pennies. So we're gonna do one, six. So let's add it up together. What is two plus six? Eight, good. Now, what is five plus one? That's correct, six. So our answer is 68 cents. Okay, let's move on to another one. And I want you to do it on your own. Okay? So, you have 48 times 48, sorry, four, the eight cents, four dimes and eight pennies. Now you get another 20 cents. So now I want you to add that up. First thing that we do is we go to the penny side. Eight plus zero equals eight. And two plus, sorry, four plus two equals six. <gasps> Look at that. It equals the same. Okay. Now for the rest of these, um, I am going to fill it out for you. And then I want you to answer it on your own. Okay. So after I finish with this, I want you to put pause, okay? And then I want you to add them up by, your, by yourself. Yes? Okay, let's do it. So we're gonna put 29 and 62. Over here it's gonna be 71 and 16. Over here, it's gonna be 80 cents plus 12. Okay. And over here, we're gonna have 90 cents plus five cents. Don't forget to put that zero. Over here, we're gonna do 86 cents. And, oh, okay, 86 cents. And um, we're gonna do, I'm so sorry. And then we're gonna do 10 cents. Over here, it's going to be 29 cents plus 45 cents. Okay, now it's your turn to try to add it up together. Remember, the first thing that we do is we add the ones column 
from top to bottom. So nine plus two would equal 11. So 11, we would put one here, and then we would carry the other one on top. So now it's one plus two, three, good job. And what's three plus six? Nine. So our answer is 91 cents. Now I want you to continue doing that for the rest of the problems by yourself. I will leave a period of time right now so that you can pause the video, put pause, and then finish doing that on your paper. So what I want you to do is this paper right here, I want you to fill it out with all of these numbers, and then I want you to add them. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask your parents, and if they have any questions, um, you can let them know that they can contact me. Okay, um, that is it for today. As soon as you finish your worksheet for this lesson, I would like you to finish your classwork math worksheet. It should look something um, like this. Okay, and don't forget to keep on practicing your math facts. Um, they are the fives for the subtraction. You will have a test for them on Friday. Um, like I said, I miss you all so dearly, and I wish I can see you um, sooner. But um, for now, this will have to do. Um, you are in my prayers, and I can't wait to see you again. Totus tuus, Maria.